Hey everyone, welcome to my channel if you're new or welcome back if you're not. So for today's video I'm doing my second Super Bowl inspired makeup look. This one is inspired by the Falcons. And if you haven't seen, I did a Patriots one that went up yesterday. So I will have that linked in a card here and also down below if you'd like to see that. But for today's look, I've done like a winged out smoky eye concentrating on a lot of black and a strong white um, highlight. I have a touch of red glitter going on above the liner on the lid. And then the lip, I did two options again like the last one where I just did a plain red lip and then I did this black and red lip, which I much prefer. I think it's cooler. And I feel like it looks like a cartoon villain lip. I don't know why, but that's what it reminds me of. So if you'd like to see how to get this look, then just keep watching. So I've already primed my eye with my usual eye primer. I'm starting with a white base for my highlights. I'm using a white gel liner from Inglot and I'm popping that under my brow and in the inner corner. Then with a synthetic fluffy brush, I'm blending out the edges of those. As my highlight shadow then, I'm taking a white shimmery eyeshadow and popping that over those white areas. And then to set anywhere I haven't applied that highlight, I'm taking a matte cream eyeshadow and buffing it all over with a blending brush. For my transition shade, I'm taking a light matte brown eyeshadow and buffing that into the crease and blending outwards. And I'll also pop that under the eye as well. Then taking a matte dark brown shadow and buffing that into the crease but not blending out quite as far as the light brown. Then for the lid I'm taking a matte cream shade and a flat shader brush and packing that onto the lid starting from the inner corner. And then from the outer corner I'm buffing in my light brown. So next onto liner, I'm using a black gel and I'm popping that on my top lash line and winging it out to start off. And then extending that on the inside to create an inner corner point. And finally, I'm popping it into the lower wash line and lower lash line. I'm then going in with a matte black shadow on a small smudger brush and starting to smudge out that liner on the lower lash line, blending it downwards. Then going back to my dark brown on my fluffy brush, I'm blending out the edges of that black underneath. And here I'm just extending the black in to meet the inner corner point and closing up that gap that I had left. Then sticking with that same brush and matte black, we're going to start smoking out the top corner. So I'm running that above my liner along the wing and taking it into the corner of the crease and also the very outer corner of the lid. And then once I'm happy with that shape, I'll start blending into the crease and along the wing. And then I'll just keep packing on colour and blending out until I'm happy. Next I'm adding the glitter and for my adhesive I'm using Too Faced Glitter Glue and a liner brush and just popping that above my liner just across the lid, not out onto the wing. And then I just carefully place on the red glitter again using my liner brush. Then for lashes I'm just applying a quick coat of mascara first on my top and bottom lashes and then I'm applying some falsies. I'm using the Inglot 30 ends but they're kind of custom cut and stacked. I have one that's cut down to three quarter length and one that's cut down to corner length and I have them stacked on top of one another so that they're more wingy at the edge and they're a little bit fuller. 
Then for my brows, I'm just using the dark brown eyeshadow that I was using before and taking that on an angled brush. I'm just outlining my brow and then filling it in. And then I started to get a sun glare into my face, so I had to pull down the blinds so the lighting will change a little bit now. But now we're moving on to the face and I'm first applying a mattifying primer all over as I'm oily. And then I'm applying foundation. I've mixed two different foundations again and I'm just dotting that all over and then buffing it in. And then using a synthetic fluffy brush, I'm applying concealer under the eyes. And then taking my broken but trusty Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, I'm just setting all of that. I'm using Max Harmony Blush for a contour then and popping that under my cheekbones, around my hairline and under the jawline as per usual. Then using one of my favourite blushes which is Suede from Sleek, I'm popping that on the apples of the cheeks and blending backwards. Then switching to a smaller brush and applying a highlight, this one is from Sleek, just onto the tops of the cheekbones, um, on my cupid's bow and down the centre of the nose. Okay, so onto the lip, I started with just a plain red, so I'm just using a red lip liner, outlining my lip, getting the shape the way I want it, and then filling in with the same colour. So this is the look with just the plain red lip. But to make it a little bit cooler then, I've gone for a black and red ombre lip. So I'm taking a black eyeliner pencil and it's kind of a hard formula pencil. This one is from Rimmel rather than a softer eyeliner pencil like say the Urban Decay one because I still want to be able to get my shape and it not to be too creamy. So I'm literally just lining around the edges with the black and then I'll start rubbing my lips together to get it to kind of blend in. And then I'll go back in with my red pencil and just touch up any areas that's too black or touch up any areas that are too red until I'm happy with the kind of ombre fade. And then once you finish that, you can just do a little dance and you're done. So that is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching guys, I really appreciate it. And if you did enjoy, don't forget to give it a thumbs up so I know that you like this kind of video and it helps me out a lot. And also if you haven't already, do subscribe while you're here, I'd love to have you on board. You can click right here to do that. And if you'd like to see my latest video, you can click right here to do that. So that is all from me for today. I'll be back very soon with a few Valentine's tutorials, so do look out for those. So I will see you then. Bye guys. I'd love to have you on board. You can su Hey, stop. Here, I'd love to have you. Oh, Minty, stop. While you're here, I. Minty, stop. Get into bed. You eejit.